Hey, it brought my right guy. I was worried it was gonna bring the wrong guy in. Rambling on about construct. Well, anyway, as long as she's fighting on our side, I'm not complaining. Later. I'm not in the mood for chat. Be safe out there. Greetings, child. S get. I hope I have the right guy. Level five on my guns and my armor. I think my armor is leveled up, but oh well. What's melee again? Oh, yeah, yeah. Attack without aiming. Campus. The big man on campus. I got a couple of chunky monkeys in front of me. Reloading! Watch out! Here they come! Come to me if you want to kill. Bye-bye! 
Get a little shotgun sniper rifle. Cover me! Not be over. This man has wall hacks, yo. Oh shit. Coming in behind you. Yeah. I have my heal. I just died to fall damage. Yeah, I saw that. It's on my stream. Clip it and ship it. Dude, look, like, I could jump and touch the roof. I fell from there. Yeah, I fell much further earlier and didn't take nearly as much. Hit up with that flank. Home of Knowledge. Let's take it. Doink. Ah. We're going backwards, son, son. Yes, sir.
See so purple. Drifter's mask. We all get it, just take it. Don't yell at me. Friendly. Negative. Can we just go around in a circle. We just went around in a circle. I am so smart. Ah, uh, wasn't uncovered for me, so it didn't show up on the mini map. It's your deal, bro. Killed ya. Big slam. Hey, Colin. Yep. Did you end up buying that Dragon Quest game? Oh, no. I got tons of stuff to play right now. Just on Here, like, in a minute. I was just gonna say, it's a good thing you didn't, because they just released the definitive edition for it. I'm warning ya! 
So if you would have bought it before, you wouldn't have got like the extra, I don't know, content that comes with it. You know, I would have been angry, but yeah, no, it's just on a list of stuff. I've still got a bunch of stuff to play right now. Who's there? Yeah, no problem. It kind of sucks because I bought it for the Step PlayStation, away, and then they kind of this definitive edition with extra content. <laughs> but you can't buy that extra content separately. I have to buy right, the game right. all over again. Well, that's garbage. Which, it is garbage, and I'm not going to do it. Don't mind leaving my effect. Mind your feet, though. <laughs> now get on. <laughs> you got more road than me. If I go back to the checkpoint, will I get healed? Uh, yeah, if we all click on it, but then it'll respawn all these dudes. Oh, so I should just hit Q then? Is that what I use to heal? Either that or hit your uh, blood wart button. Like, one, two, three, or four, whatever the red one is. Oh, okay, cool. Uh, yeah, there's traps. Doing okay? Oh, shit. Watch my back! You can see that. Watch my back! Coming. Full. Man, I'm playing with my video settings and my OBS settings, and this game still destroys OBS. My stream looks like shit. Break out 
that credit card. Get that new desktop. I love the panic roll. I thought I was gonna make him blow up right in my face. I just thought you meant me because I was going ham with my melee. Nope. That guy turned around 25 times. Why do Apple products suck? Because they're made in China. Pop off, stay down. Love China. He's down. Stop off. Do you have an iPhone? No, but a lot of my customers do, and they can't connect to the hotspot. <laughs> apparently, Apple runs on a different. Honestly. Yeah. You should talk to Kirk and get a different router set up. Like, it's been uh, however many we, years. We, uh, he said it would be like a couple hundred bucks to set up a whole new Wi Fi system down there. Like, per month. Shut up. That's what he said. He's coming out to fix the router because it is bunked up right now. Empty! Just going by what he said, but I'm gonna yeah, ask him he's a crisis. fucking ripoff artist. That's all we got to work with right now, unfortunately. But I'm going to, uh... Watch my back! Do we have the key for this place? Yeah, we got it yeah. at the first checkpoint. Jump for the traps. I don't even know what just hit me. I think it was collateral from Gil walking through a tripwire. I didn't walk through a tripwire, I was behind all of you. No, I think it was me. I just didn't see the tripwire, oh. and I didn't, I didn't see what hit me. It was a tripwire. 
Yeah, but what actually but, hit me? Like, it literally threw me backwards. There, it exploded. Oh, I didn't see Hunting the explosion. Pistol. Yeah, take it. We all get it. This is not like the... Well, sometimes an old man forgets, you know? There's somebody dead here. Probably deserved it. Hunting pistol is pretty nice. Yeah, I'm probably gonna switch to it. So I have a little bit of range, even though... So you can do 100 because it's going to drop once I uh, switch it to the hunting rifle. Or this one. I'm seriously considering getting, uh... Cover me! Uh, uh, whatever, the virgin internet up at the house, and then just having a Wi-Fi ticket system down at the cottages. Good. Compare the prices. Christ, dude. What? You literally ran right beside a trap and it somehow didn't go off. Oh. I'm sick of our internet going down and the phone lines going down in a fucking... A strong gust of wind. I'm gonna... Virgin's gotta be pretty expensive, right? Reloading! I think it was 80 bucks a month unlimited for like 30 up, 30 down. Well, that's not bad. Yeah. Boy, I had it for a bed. But, uh, something went wrong with the wire in the house and they would have to rewire the whole house. Which I don't understand, but... Yeah, like, that's what I hate about not knowing about this stuff. Like, it sounds like Scam City. Ow, that one hit me. Yeah, it does. I don't understand. Well, obviously don't know anything about technology, but... I see that one. He's down. Watch my back. Careful, exploding. Running low. Archer. Where'd the archer go? He dead it. Hunting pistol does 450 yeah. headshot. Reloading. Watch my back! And if you know my McCree gameplay, all I do is hit heads. Right, go. You're cracked. I was trying to stop swinging there. Didn't work. But I do have a heal. I have a heal as well. I'm the medic. Here. However, you didn't let me finish. We're also like right beside another checkpoint. 
This is the start of level, is it not? Yeah. So we're leaving. This was a one-way level. One-way street. Oh, campfire smells so good. I've got Scott coming on Saturday, and then two weeks after that, you and Greg. Should be a good month. And then I'll come up too. Fuck no. I want to bring my COVID with you. Or with me. Even if they open the borders, I'm not taking Americans this year. Well, I'm fully booked regardless, so it doesn't matter. Even this American? Yep. Sorry, buddy. Your country needs to get its act together. Hey, I wear my mask. I respect you for that. I wash my hands sometimes. I bet you don't even wipe your hands after you wipe your ass. I know what hand. hand sanitizer is. What do you need? Oh, he's got the hunting rifle. Can only one person talk to this guy at a time. Yep. yep. And I'm going to take my time since you're pushing me around and meleeing me. I'm meleeing the guy. Hey, traveler. Yeah, well, I'm taking collateral damage here. Your health is full. You're full. Oh, shit. Till next time. Back. I took one third of the iron this lady is selling. Oh, do I. S uh... I love the what? hunting rifle. Yeah? Better be worth my time. We're gonna buy it. Take care, my friend. No wait. Oh, traveler. Ah, let's see what I've got. <sighs> I've got work to do. <sighs> be safe out there. Hello, traveler. I guess you were in line. Oh, traveler. Ah, let's see what I've got. Hello, traveler. I'm not in the mood for chat. You do you, boo boo. So long. No, I accidentally upgraded the top fucking item again. <laughs> Dumbo. Damage. What? What do you need? Oh, you fat bitch. It's 8.30. Yeah, I know. 9.30 in the real world. Take care, my friend. I was finding paths last night. It's pretty fun. Did I got a badass new weapon. Did you find the, the path? Uh, yeah. 
Nice. We got a badass new weapon. We got um, killed the bot, the a mini boss. Got challenged one on one combat. Where the fuck do I go? Return to the last checkpoint. We just gotta leave that area and then. Oh yeah, true, 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 true. What do you play as, Gil? Like, what's your race and class? Um, since there's only three of us that can reliably get together, I'm playing two player characters. The first one is a human alchemist. Throws bombs and whatnot. Cool. And then the other one's a human fighter, but he's a dual-wielding fighter. So you're Tracer. With swords. <laughs> Or maces, or flails, or or Bears daggers. Alive. You and your damn speakers, son, son. Oh, could you hear yourself? Yeah, so not loudly. I gotta figure that out. It's for so on Zoom last night. It didn't work very well because Zoom. I just have the mic open on my stream. It's not that bad because it only opens when I make it open. Chill here. Gil just, uh, he's been having internet issues. Gil left channel and disconnected. I was wondering why he didn't respond to the weapon choices I said. Yeah, the last couple days his internet's been a lot worse than mine. Well, mine's fine for me. Just not Apple users. They can, they can connect to the Wi-Fi easily. It's the hotspot. That's the problem. Welcome back, Gilbert Grape. Thanks. How's that internet treating you? Great. You love it? Love it. <laughs> no, uh, the last thing I heard was Purge getting mad at Colin about speakers or something. I just said nice speakers, son, son. Yeah, I was. I had my mic open while he was talking so he could hear. I, I don't have a... Like, this mic is supposed to not pick up anything behind it, but I think the speaker from my computer is too close to it. That's why you need a boom. Get that sucker on a boom and up above your monitor, then BAM, problem solved. Above my monitor, the speaker would be launching directly into it. I need it, like, down under my, like, under my chin at my chest. Huh. Well then. Not toss me an invite. I would fucking love to, Gil. I think this mic still works great. Uh, where it is right now. It says the session is full. That's weird. We shall back out and remake. Yeah, it should. It should remember where our that we just came from that checkpoint, so we should be fine. Well, at any rate, Colin, Colin just, you'd ask which uh, weapons I use. One second, it just switched my character, Colin. Just make sure you're on the right character. So, that's the thing. I don't, it doesn't matter what I choose. It Basically, your invite dictates. I think it oh, picks... Oh, okay. I think it picks my character that is closest in level to your character. Uh, anyways, yeah, Guild. I was just making a guess, because Jay said Tracer. And I was like, well... Tracer without guns, so like swords or maces or flails or daggers. But I am interested. So, do you, do you know what a Kopesh is? Yes, it's a very cool sword. Yeah, it's an Egyptian type uh, heavy blade. I have that in my right hand and I have a light mace on my left. And I, I can trip people, I'm kind of special, specialized in tripping. It's like a. It's like a curved blade. It's very neat. Yeah, have you ever watched The Mummy? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> it's like what all the uh, Egyptian guys use. Yeah. I saw it again recently in a different show. I couldn't I couldn't name it off the top of my head, but it was really cool. Just as, I'm like, I know what that is. Nice. Oh, and I also got a uh, composite short bow. 
what that means is like a short bow or like ranged weapons in general don't really take any bonuses for like strength damage or whatever unless it's composite so like they make it extra hard to pull the string back right right so then you can put in your strength modifier on damage as well which is pretty neat yeah we we've only played two sessions of our D D run now round. and we have uh one character Who's like an elven druid that for some reason started with a sword. Until next time. Or sorry, started with a spear. But their strength is so low that they get like negative, negative attack rolls with their spear. Yeah. And we're like, just get a different attack. weapon. And they're like, no, I really like my spear. Anything you need? <laughs> ah, let's see what I've got. I'm like fair, you can play it however you want. Keep moving. You just gonna suck. My uh alchemist last night, he took a potion and al and allowed him to breathe fire. Blue fire on the enemies was pretty badass. And I gave another potion to, to my uh, little sneaky rogue buddy, turned him invisible, snuck around the bad guy, and just popped him. Yeah, I don't. We're playing with pretty basic classes in DD. I don't know if there's anything like that in DD. Oh, there definitely is. If you have a sorcerer or a wizard. We do have a. I can't remember. We do have a magic user. I can't remember if he's a sorcerer or a wizard, but... Either way, one of them should be able to cast invisibility once they get high enough level. Like, we're playing... Like, we just leveled up to five, so we're a little bit higher. Oh, yeah, our guys are... Oh, I think our guys hit three in the last session. But the first two levels are super easy to get with the campaign we're playing, so... Yeah. Sorry, I had a little yeah. rat-a-tat-tat. The, the cool door, thing about the door, door. The cool thing about X. Oh, can you hear? Me? Sort of. You you cut out there, but I can hear you. The cool thing about XP is you can just do whatever you want. <laughs> like you can definitely use the XP blocks or stat blocks or whatever that the monsters are rated to give, or you can do like milestone level ups, like. Hey, you've completed this little part of your journey. You leveled up. Yeah, that's what that's what our campaign is doing for the first couple levels. Is like if you guys complete these quests, you get two levels or whatever. Yeah, I like that. I like that a lot better. Actually, it makes it feel like you're accomplishing things. If that makes sense. No. Yeah. Totally. I I, I don't mind it. Uh. But I think everyone Look also up, likes, like, come. like we're playing on, like, a, there's a D&D &D helper website called D&D &D Beyond. And, like, I heard you can, about that. I heard it's awesome. Yeah, you can totally just, like, put in XP and you see a bar go up. So it's, like, gamifying the XP itself. Like, you can see your bar go up. Nice. And that everyone, everyone really likes killing monsters just to see the XP bar go up. I mean, you can also give out bonus XP for interactions and roleplay too, right? Yeah, I'm still I'm still learning that sort of stuff. Honestly, I'm still learning how to just cope with people going off script. Oh my God, that's so annoying. In a couple I've run, it's like okay, okay, it's it's not really bearing on the story, so it's kind of rain it in. <laughs> but like, we have one guy that's like, he's a rogue, and he's like, I hide. And then he's like, I pickpocket everyone. Oh no, you got one of those guys? <sighs> Whoa. Yeah, like, roll a stealth check. Roll a stealth check. Roll a stealth check. Sometimes I'll be like, these. nobody in this room has anything to worry about. Like, is he just trying to rob regular NPCs like yeah like sometimes. In town? uh not in town usually on a mission 
And like there, there, there are cases like I, I don't want to discourage him from doing it because there are cases where he could have pickpocketed a like a key or something. Reload. Sure. But he always thinks of it at like the most, like the worst times. Like you've thought to pickpocket everybody till now, but you run into like the one dude that survived this entire massacre, and you don't think to pickpocket this guy for a key. <laughs> a good way to uh, not necessarily discourage it, but make them use it more wisely is attempt have him attempt it like on a kind of a tougher enemy that catches him and like really beats the shit out of him. <laughs> You know what I mean? like, yeah, yeah, no, I, I totally, I totally know. It's he's mostly attempted it on very like, like a bunch of gnomes that are like scared for their lives, so they're not even gonna fight him about it. Like hey, he hasn't actually attempted it on somebody that would fight back. Just have have him try to do it like on a if he does ever does it in town, just make the guy pickpockets like a he's an undercover cop. <laughs> Sorry, I just walked in front of you. That's right. Yeah, he's like an undercover cop, though. And then he just stops him dead in his tracks and just, like, <clears throat> arrests him or something stupid like that. That'd teach him. Would that learn him? Might, might learn him. Yeah, I'm trying to, I'm still trying to get more flexible with, uh, with what I do. So it's a learning process for everyone. Like everyone is a new. No one has ever played D D. Me or any of the actual party. I shouldn't have stood there. I mean, it's all fun, and it's all fun, you know, to do that stuff when you're and everybody's just starting out. And eventually, you know, you're gonna have that guy that keep doing that, and everybody's gonna be like, "I just want to continue with the story." Oh my god! Yeah, I, I imagine people will figure it out as we go. But like, no one, no one's complaining yet. We're all still having fun. My, my, I only roll my eyes when I'm like, guys, there's like this really cool thing around the corner, and you're spending like half an hour just searching this room. <laughs> Just wait until you, like, prep an entire encounter. Like, multiple enemies, unique enemies, they have cool abilities, and then they take, like, a different direction and don't even encounter. Yeah. Like, I, I, I don't think I'll be to creating my own anytime soon. Oh, we just went the wrong way, I think. Yeah, come to me. I'm at the promised land. Oh, the, there's a bunch of different ways. Okay, I get it. I get it. I'm a moron. I heard I'm a moron. Not, I'm on my way. Just so you know. Both I are accurate. You are a moron. Nailed. Nailed. Nailed it. We never like this tree talks in a language we can't understand. We've never found any way to actually talk to the tree. Let's talk to him like this. Oh my god, that damage. actually started a quest. It's an evil tree, it says it's an evil tree. The little red the little red things on the tree are are pain points. Get a necklace. Increases armor effectiveness. Ooh, that's nice. Also here. That was mostly for me. No, it's only for you. I'm a skill have a sliver missing. Ooh, I might wear this. Increases armor effectiveness by 30%. 
I do hope to like make this a melee build. Let's touch the stone so I can get some uh, ammo. I'm sorry, I was doing things. No, you weren't doing anything. You don't know about that. You don't know me. It's my purse. Oh, king of the hill. That's my purse, you don't know me. Hoof. I don't know you. The mosquitoes are out tonight. Same here, brother. You have mosquitoes where you are? Yeah. I'm sorry, I've never been to Iowa. Do you have... It's like the same climate as you. Running water where you are? Uh, no, actually I don't. Do you have potatoes? Uh, nope, that's Idaho. Yeah, oh, no. you're thinking the other eye. I'm well aware. Are you, though? Yeah, there was one night... I'm pretty sure it was Gil and Rusty Balls got into a heated... conversation about this. Wasn't Rusty trying to tell me what my state was known for? <laughs> yes, yeah, that's what it was. That's exactly it. <laughs> oh, dude, I'm pretty sure it's potatoes. It's like, I live here. And he wasn't, like, trying to troll. He was genuinely thinking that that it, was yeah. what Iowa was known for. That's Rusty in a nutshell, though. Never have been would never ever admit that he's wrong. Never give up. Never surrender. <laughs> yep. It was fucking annoying. Never admit fault. I'm right and the whole world is wrong. Alright, where is... Where is we go? Uh, I don't know. I'm exploring over beyond. Oh yeah, we should go to where you are. I think that's the way we need to go. I don't know how to get to where you are. Go through that building you just went through. Okay, don't climb this fire escape because it leads to nowhere but wasted time. Oh, I've been up there before in a different game and there was a chest up there. So they must randomize that too. Yeah, there was. I act actually remember that fire escape. That's kind of funny because we haven't played this portion of the game in a long time. Yeah, but I remember weird stuff like like just a rando fire escape that I'm like, oh, thank God, there's a reason to go up here. True. They call me Quick Draw. Alright, I think we're going towards boss territory here. I kind of recognize this exit. I recognize that I'm probably going to lose my power around 1.30 a.m. tonight. Well, let's get in Warzone. In. Yeah, we'll play some Warzone in a bit. Is there a storm rolling in? Yeah. Uh Big fucking storm about the size of my fist on the radar. My fist is huge, bro. Little, little baby fist. Little baby fist. Cinder blocks, baby bro. Baby hand purge. Dude. Dude. Yes. Come on, dude. I got this beer. It's called the Orange Wizard. A G O S E gas ghost 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 sour, sour, ghosts are sour pretty ale good. with orange. I was gonna guess it was a sour. It's not bad. Man, those sour beers when you don't know they're sour just really fucking throw you for a loop. Yeah, it's like uh, it's like when it warheads. Yes. Yeah. But it was like eating a piece of chicken for me the first time I had a sour beer. 
like, holy fuck, they actually make these things. First hour of beer I had was called, like, Ziggy Stardust or something. Uh -huh. It's a local company here in Iowa. Made it. That shit was super sour. Was this a I thought you were in Idaho. Uh, yep. Where all the Known uh, for our corn tires. is. <laughs> Going through, I think this might be the dragon. This is the dragon, I think. 100% is until he climbs the building and ascends. Spoiler alert, Gil. Looks like a tree. Shoot that big they are the root. Chest. It's a root dragon. It's weird that a dead tree can shoot fire and not catch himself on fire. I'm still gonna shoot him with fire. Alright, I'm going in for melee, boys. He looks like he's angry at me. You're gonna want a Q, Gil. So if you're burning, if you do dive rolls, it gets you off burning. What is this thing? Behind you. Whoever's over there. Is this water or oil? It's all oil. Looks like it's oil. Trying. Oh, he's on us, stump. He's on us, stump. I'm gonna pop my heel right beside you. Whoever's rolling. I'm the idiot rolling it right into the fire, yes. I wish I could have stopped that, but I'm just bad at this. Just looking at... Ouch! business. Oh, we turned to face me. Yeah, I'm killing minion. I gotta heal now. Okay, okay. Bar. Don't get too fuck close, apparently. One more bar.
I do have a heal. I was in the process of popping mine. You can pop who, whoever's with me. I think it's gone. Yeah, that's me. I'm dry. Focus him. Woo. Good job. Good job. Blazing heart. Well done, gentlemen. Did you hear that? I think that's the only the second time I've fought him. The only time I fought him before now was in the, like, roguelite. Yeah, the, uh... Yeah. Endless mode, whatever you call it. <clears throat> yeah. Uh, adventure mode, maybe? Adventure mode, that's what Just... it is. Where's John been? What the fuck? He's been off like for a week. Like him gone for a full week and a half. Yeah. Oh? Maybe he's throwing Ricky Bobby on us. John wouldn't do that to me. He loves me too much. That's what you said about Ricky. Ricky still talks to me. Yeah. Not to rub it in, Gil. While we sit at the checkpoint, I'm going to the washroom. Yeah, I'm traveling back to Ward 13. And I also have to pee Gilbert. Fine, I guess I'll pee too. Wanna to play swords? Yep. Deal, I always win. Mine's down here, though. Oh, shit. <laughs>
Dude! You know, there's still a lot of deadwood out there, but that thing was a different level of hurt. Later. So you brought down that blind beast in the city, eh? I can hardly believe it. You're made of sterner stuff. What do you need? Can you upgrade your melee weapon? Or does it only shoot traits? No, you can upgrade it the same as your guns. Take care, my friend. Ah, good to see you again. Keep moving. Certainly. Uh, now kill the rest uh, of them. Uh, yeah? Better be worth my time. <sighs> I've got work to do. This is an interesting development. Take care, my friend. Does your armor change? Ah, good to see you again. No, As you level it up? No. Mine looks different because I bought a skin for it, but... That'd have been cool if it looked different as he leveled it up. Be safe out there. About a third of each. Hey, so I got we we got a new weapon via the yeah, dragon's you, drop. What do you need? On this guy? It's a different type of SMG. I don't see it. No, you gotta or go. You gotta bitch. go to the lady. Yeah. yeah okay. She's not yeah, a bitch. I call her a bitch. She's just. She, she's just not nice. She is a, a CNX Tuesday. Hello there, friend. Needing any scrounge? Spitfire. Spit flames or ignite targets. It looks sick, actually. Uh, what? Where do I find it? On the lady. At the bitch. Okay. This bitch right I here. I got work to do. Jesus if this Christ. is you. No, that's gone. No, I'm the one wearing the skin. Oh, you have the gun. What? I didn't buy it. I'm gonna hold off. Fine. Let's have a look. Dude, I, I calls them as I seize them. Do you want the Spitfire? Yeah, I just bought it. Caller and I have beaten the game and we haven't seen that go. Safe out there. I think she is kind of a bitch. Damien sent me a friend request on Facebook. Who? Damien. Do you mean man? I didn't want to say last name on stream, but yes. What, like, all of my zero users are going to hear it? Yeah, but now I know it. I do have someone in here that does not look like a bot. Or could be a bot that I haven't seen before. K3JRU. If you're a real person, say hi, bud. Say hi to us. We are friendly Canadians with one person that loves potatoes. I do love potatoes. I yeah, love potatoes too. We have more than we have more than one person here that loves potatoes. What what your favorite kind of potato? Hash brown. Ooh. Good call. 
I, I like mean one. potato triangle. <laughs> I like this. You I remember like those from school? Potato. No, it's a potato chevron. Sorry, potato chevron. What's a chevron? <laughs> I'm a big fan of double baked potatoes with uh, chives and bacon and sour cream. Yeah, Those yeah. are really good. Good baked potato. Oh, I forgot about this. It's gotta be double baked though. The keg double baked potato? Dude, you remember those potatoes I made on New Year's? No. Oh! I, I, what about? I genuinely don't. What about scalloped potatoes? I do like scalloped they're potatoes. They're good if they're cooked right. With a little bit of crunch on the top, like creamy busyness on the inside. Crunch on, crunch no, on the, first. crunch on the outside, not on the top, yeah. like on the outside. Wait, yeah, like, uh, like, like ar caramels. around the, around the little rim. Oh, shit! Are you guys here? Yeah, it, sure does, it doesn't matter. Who cares? This guy looks like pixelated garbage because I've turned all my settings down in the hopes to try to make OBS like this better. Oh, he just, he just resolved. What's the worst kind of potato? Mashed. I'm gonna go ahead and no. say hashed. No, mashed potatoes are good. You just get some salt and pepper on there, it's pretty good. Yeah, but they, they can't have chunks in them. You oh, you, they gotta be pro they gotta be proper mashed, yeah. They gotta be I like creamy mashed potatoes. potatoes. I was gonna say soggy potato wedges, because those are the worst. Honestly, True. I'm not a big fan of fries. Straight Did up. Just fight him? Oh, okay. No, 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 he transports us to the labyrinth. I uh, I back talked every response. You didn't answer my question. <laughs> Um, yeah, that's a good choice. I don't like chunky mashed potatoes. Chunky mashed potatoes are disgusting. What about mashed potatoes with the skin still kind of in it? Is that no, what you no don't skin. like? No, no skin. No. That's where all your vitamins come from. The only skin No, my vitamins come potato. from pooping. The only, the only skin I want on a potato is from uh, appetizers potato. Uh, what the fuck do you call them? I forget the name. Good one. No, you know what Good I'm chat. talking about. I have no idea what you're saying. You know what the potatoes, the appetizers potato that skins. you get. Potato skins? Is that what it's called? You get the skin with a little oh, bit yeah, of potato yeah, yeah, and yeah. bacon. Yeah, yeah, bacon yeah. and cheese and sour cream and chives. Yes, yes, that's... Uh, those are, those are alright. That's the only skin I want on my potato. Potato skin is pretty good. Like, but I, I, I like to have one and I'm like, we should have ordered like cheese sticks. Yeah, yeah. yeah, mozzarella sticks are always a better choice. Oh, hell yeah. That's why I always get matzo sticks at fucking Arby's, bro. Yep. Oh man, I have two of those matzo of sticks marinara. though. I have two of those matzo sticks, and I'm like, oh my god, these are like so rich, or I don't know, like you can only have two, and then I'm like, I feel like awful. As uh, as knowing you're a fat man along with me, I don't agree with that. Uh, yeah, I, I don't agree you. either. I'll eat it until I throw it up. <laughs> no, I have two. I have two, two of the Arby's ones, which are nicely, like, seasoned, I guess, on the breading. But, like, I have two, and I'm like, ugh. Do I have to go up there and touch something? No, we're going the wrong way. I think we gotta go straight. Yeah, oh, wait. We oh. don't have the pe puzzle piece for that. I think we gotta go to back down. I'm gonna wait for you guys, because you can die from this if someone goes on the stairs and then leaves. So I'm I'm gonna throw out an unpopular opinion I I think but I'm a really big fan of how do I use this dumb thing space what is it no no just walk onto it just, just walk into back it. off and walk onto it yeah. um bar food mozzarella sticks like the little mini mozzarella sticks they're like the tiny ones the little tiny one I do like they the look tiny like ones thumbs. yeah yeah yes. I love those. Yeah, yeah, no, those because are... Because they're full of grease. <laughs> yeah, no, those are on fire. I like that. I think we want to go where I'm going. 
I think this one guarantees us. You were hoping I'd die. Me? Yeah, I saw you turn around and look at me. Oh, I'm waiting. <laughs> Synchronized jumping. What's the I, best appetizer out there? Mozzarella stick. Okay. Disagree. What do you think the best appetizer is? So often wings are are on the appetizer menu, so I'm I'm gonna go with wings if those count as Boo. an appetizer. No, not in your case they don't because you order them as a main and an appetizer. Do you really? So, it's fucked up. That's true. He he does eat shit ton of wings wherever he goes. Uh, uh, yes, I would like, um... I had wings for wings dinner tonight. with a side of wings. Thank you. I had wings for dinner tonight. I mean, I love me some chicken wings, but... I think the best I appetizer... I did not expect you? Yeah. Fried chicken gizzards. It's gotta be... It's gotta be cheese sticks, or... Yet you have opened the gates. A second new... I like, uh... I, I want to say nachos, be. but I order that as main. Yeah, no, I was going to say nachos too, man. Like, nachos is a little happy before, it's great. The Guardian. Yet I thought and other than that, all I can think of is... Are you not... Uh, Caesar salad. They opened the Chicken gates. Caesar salad. Only the new weekend. So, uh, in that... Remember that sort of fancy restaurant that used to be above the... I don't know, Bush... Bush League, whatever that was called, Bush Company? Um, they had bacon oh, yes. wrap, bacon wrap dates as an appetizer. That shit is great. That sounds cool. I've been watching a lot of Hell's Kitchen. At least I have never seen your life. And I kind of want to try risotto. None of that name or Risotto is good. Elizabeth I've never makes had risotto. risotto. Elizabeth makes risotto every once in a while. It's good. Is it up to Chef Ramsay's <laughs> standards? Uh, no, I have no fucking or it's idea. Fucking thick as shit. Yeah, or raw. <laughs> he makes it's it with a lot. Of, yes. He makes it with a lot yes. of cheese, which I'm all on board for. Perhaps so. you are the one after all. I had a uh, risotto at not. like the fancy culinary yeah, school right. restaurant here in town. But I would. <laughs> A lot of butter, some salt, him will not be easy. rice, peas. Take caution. I mean, I don't know. I didn't make it, so. Like all Akari. I don't know. I am I'd like to try risotto to because I do like rice. I'm starting to like it more born. and more. Oh, discerning one. I like a, a good uh, fish joy, dish. My great. Dude, I love fish. To like help good you salmon. Newy, who was a nun. Or cod. Only one. I've come around to fish a lot since I moved to Toronto. I used to not care for fish, but I've come around a lot. Don't you eat sushi now? Oh, sushi is fantastic. Sushi's really good. Well, that's, I've never had sushi because it looks like Play-Doh to me, but I'm willing to try it. Oh man, I think you'd like it. I think you'd like it. Dude, if it has a consistency of Play-Doh, I love it because I ate so much Play-Doh when I was a kid. Since time forgotten, he rules from the citadel. In the canyons beyond it's like the Elmer's Black Sun Gate. The gate has been sealed since time for Oh my god, I mean, shut up, lady. Go well just sorry, like, I've just been carrying on because I like the discussion about food. Just like, um, I like fish. Just like fish dishes in general. All the different sushis out there have all different tastes too. Spicy salmon. Really... Spicy salmon's my go to. That's good. I like crunchy rolls. Crunchy rolls, I do like crunchy. And you, crunchy anything, honestly. Yep, exactly. Crunchy anything. How do you have crunchy sushi? Is they, it sushi uh, just raw shit? No, it's not. So that's the that's a misconception. It is, can be, but like the actual rolls are generally not raw. They're just cooked fish or battered fish in a, in a roll with a rice and seaweed and stuff. And it's honestly the rolls are where it's at to if you want to get into it from the ground floor. Honestly, the first roll I ever had didn't even have fish in it. It was an avocado roll, and it was still fantastic. Those are pretty good. I've never had avocado either. It's very good. You never had no guacamole? No. It, the color and... Why is there a housefly on the tip of my pipe? 
It does look like a baby shat all over that fucking... Yeah, it does. It really does. <laughs> I could probably uh, de-pit an avocado perfectly after watching probably 200 hours of Hell's Kitchen in the last three months. I will be right back in two to three minutes, pipe time. Be right back. The thing I learned the most of Hell's Kitchen, or about food, watching Hell's Kitchen, or like yeah. Chopped, is that deconstructed anything is just stupid. And they make a million different kinds of chutney. So I don't, I don't know officially or at least what makes a chutney a chutney, but we ordered from a place on yeah. Friday, and we ordered their equivalent of basically mozzarella sticks, but were like big fat slabs of mozzarella that were breaded and fried. Oh my god, that and sounds it, amazing! And it came with the tomato chutney, which was fantastic. But I don't know what makes a chutney a chutney. Was it was it like really thick? Yeah, it was super thick. Yeah, that's it. They just kind of like chop shit up. Like it's like it's like a thicker salsa. Hey, that's basically what it is. Also got some Alabama white sauce with it, which was actually really good. Is it ranch? <laughs> no, Alabama white sauce is uh, some sort of spicy sauce. There's like three different ingredients. One of them is horseradish, which I don't like. But it's very mild in this sauce, and it was pretty good. I don't know what the other two things are. E could say, but I don't remember. Horseradish is all right. I don't like it's horseradish like, by itself at all. It's got to be super moderation, though, right? I, I just it, I don't like the taste. I don't like the texture. I don't want it in my Caesars. I don't want it as a side. I don't want it as a sauce. What's the best condiment when eating wings? Oh, like, you just gotta get good sauce. on, Like, on the wings, I, I rarely dip my wings in, like, a side sauce. I just want a good sauce on the wings themselves. I love blue cheese. Blue cheese is good. Like, it, it's a good compliment to, uh, like, spicy wings that don't taste very good. I get some of the spicier stuff from Buffalo Wild Wings, and I know that's not like, you know, it's not great wings or anything, but Dude, I, I get from, that and I get blue cheese and it's it's really good. I order from from chain wing places. I don't, I don't, I ain't, I ain't no wing connoisseur. I just like wings. I ain't judging anybody. They get some wings, you get some wings. Okay, bone in, bone out. Uh, I, I will take both. I, I like both. Uh, sometimes I, I feel the bone in. Sometimes I prefer the bone out. It's a, See, it's a, I don't, it's a mood thing. I don't like all the extra work with the bone in. I do like. I actually do like tearing the meat off the bone sometimes. Like just straight up, I do. But like I, I like I like basically wings that are chicken nuggets as well. <laughs> That's why I don't order lobster or crab, because I don't want to do all that work to just get to the little bit of meat in there. Well, A, lobster is overrated as fuck. Um, it's a sea bug. But crab is pretty good. I've never actually eaten crab where I had to fight for the meat. I've always had just had, like, the crab meat was given to me. Same. And it's, crab's pretty good. Well, it's not, I guess it's not same. I love crab meat. Um, I got crab legs, I think. I had, like red lobster one time and you had to crack open the legs and it's like what am i doing that i've never had to do i've never been to a red lobster like i'm paying you 30 dollars to make me do all the work it's the experience nah yeah no that's not for me either i like i had no interest <laughs> Team. You're gonna have to kill dogs here, Gil. Just giving you a heads up. Oh, my dog was sick today. She threw up a bunch. What did you feed her? That ain't good. I don't know. She, she eat grass. I don't know what she ate. She threw up a ton uh, this morning. 
and would go to the door and look all sad and be like, do you need to go outside and get sick again? She'd be like, yep. I'd let her out and she'd go get sick and come back inside and just sleep for most of the day. What the fuck is going on here? This helmet's up. Yeah, that was, that did not go well. I didn't even see him. Yeah, he's like the literally first the, the first enemy. No, I started shooting guys way off in the distance. He must have been close around the yeah, rock. Yeah, he's around the rock, yeah. But she's feeling oh. better. She's running around outside now. <clears throat> Cricket. He and I still need a good dog. My brother just got a dog. I think I told you guys that. I bet your brother got a fucking lap dog. It is... well, it acts like a lap dog. It's a big boy? Or will it's be a, a big boy? Uh, it'll be probably the size of Cricket if you know what she looks like. Of course I do. You a little bit bigger. A little bit bigger than her, probably. Uh, it's a uh, black lab, Australian Shepherd, Blue Healer mix. Caught that amidst the gunfire. I did. I would love an Australian Shepherd. They're fucking beautiful dogs. And they're so smart. Yeah, they're. Well, well all Shepherds, I think, are smart if they're purebred. I think. I could be wrong if I haven't met a certain breed of Shepherd. I just. I, I'm. I'm not gonna impulse buy a dog. Ring of illusion, come your way, boys. See that? What the fuck are these things? What am I playing? Like? These are mutants. They're humans that have been ravaged. So, actually, I have read the lore about this game, and it's pretty neat. So the lore about this game is that uh, we we are now on a different planet entirely. When we started the game, we were on our... I just took a spear right to the neck. And to the shoulder, and to the- oh my god, I'm about to die. No way! Sorry, I think I got you a little bit. I can drop my heal in a second. Right now, actually. I'm coming. Sorry, uh, I was talking about the lore. I know to actually explain what has happened to this world is actually neat. So we were on Earth when we started the game. Um, and there was an invasion by a an alien species called the Root, which is why they all look like trees. Um, this planet is the only planet that ever beat the Root, and the only way they beat the Root is by nuking the entire planet. So now every this, now it's like Mad Max and everybody's a mute. Huh. I need that long ammo. Oh, but we, we, not ammo? we will see other worlds that no. haven't beat the root yet or lost to the root. <clears throat> so it's kinda neat. Like honestly, Jay and I skipped the lore in the first time because it's just like, who cares? Like we're playing the game, let's play the game. But I, as I've been playing alone. Uh, on a separate character, some of the lore is actually pretty neat.
Raider. Someone's bomb behind. Yeah, this gun is neat. Yeah, that uh, flamethrower pushed that dog back like a water hose. So basically, you, you have to build up the, the flamethrower part of it. It's like the mod of the gun. So you gotta kill things until it gets up to 50, and then if when you hit F, it changes... Changes the gun into a flamethrower. For like 50 ammo, and then it comes it goes back to what it normally is. But I got beat up there. I have my heal if you want it. Yeah. I just shot you, sir. You don't. Yeah, it's all good. Oh man. Yeah, I might need to heal. What? So that's what that was the last time we fought the dragon. Yeah. What did I miss? You bought the... Jay bought a previous... Like, upgrade. Instead of a different mod, he's using one that taunts you. I do need a heal. Oh, did I miss the heal? Yeah, I'll get it back. No, no, I'll, I'll pop a... Blood ward. Oh, what? Why does it say waiting for all players? You're glitched. Oh uh, no. If I'd been glitched the whole time, I'd just notice now. Got a door here.
Oh, damn it. Just use the fucking ammo box right where you said the door was there. Oops. Damn. I don't know what it is about going through doors, but it always switches whatever gun you have. Do not shoot that guy in the head. You can't get over there from here. You gotta go up. Back here. Heal back here. Oh no, I think I'm crashing. Oh no. Somebody is shooting me in the back of the head. Dude, you teleported. I, I, I don't know what's going on. My game is losing its mind. Where's the big boy? Did we kill him? I think he's dead. Wow, oh, that sucked. I'm back. You're alive. You're running. Yeah, no, I'm back. I just, I, I literally have no idea what happened there. Like, my game Me. stopped. Fuck. Well, I shot in the back of the head with a boat. No, and it was funny because my game stopped and nothing was yeah. happening. No. And then, like, it would skip forward and then, so, like, Tons of blood was coming out of the back of my head, and someone's shooting me. Yeah, I shot you. <laughs> and then it stopped there. Oh god! I make it, friends. Watch out! Oh no, I'm down. Fudge. I gotcha. Careful, there's a guy with a turret on his back. Yeah, there is. Got lots of time. Don't worry, Colin. I'll save you. We both saved. All me, all bitter. All me, dip, dip, potato chip. Dip, dip, hey, potato what's this chip. <clears throat> That's an That's open chest. Nothing. Dip, dip. I'm out of ammo, basically. Should have an ammo crate in your inventory. Who's next? What's it look like? Uh, a box. I'm all ammoed up. We got a big boy. Walk right in front of me. Got him. 
I need that long ammo. Yeah. How do I cure irradiated? If you have heavy water, yeah, you might have to open your inventory. So I I does that. And if you drink, if you have heavy water in there, drink it. Tasty. Hunter's Halo. I'm gonna have to take a look at these rings. Oh, uh, Gil is running in the middle of the air for me. Yeah, he's doing a running man for me. And turning around. I got my flamethrower. Okay, flamethrower is powerful AF. Okay, just back up. Back up, back up. Let's not progress. Alright, back to the checkpoint then, because that's where we're going to have to restart. Gil left channel and Unless he could join off my invite, though, party be in full. I don't, I, don't, I don't see that happening. I don't remember how to get back. I have uh, 18 train trait points available. Well, I've been spending mine. I've been just mostly just splitting them between stamina and health. I don't know, man. I got maybe half an hour before I'm going back to, before I'm going to Warzone. I mean, I just got a message on Facebook from Gil. We could probably go to Warzone now. I'm down with that. I might reboot and stop my stream and restart it because uh, I feel like my computer's struggling a bit.